What's good YouTube? It's your girl Alicia Perry and I am back with another video and if you're new to my channel make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you know when I drop these new videos. Alright y'all so I'm gonna do a story time on this club experience that I had right my first time going to a club that was actually downtown Houston okay I've been to like clubs that were like around you know what i'm saying but i had never been to a club that was downtown houston and i felt like that was big shit for me because i was like oh this is a club club you know what i'm saying and so yeah so i hooked up with some of my friends and they're like oh we're gonna go to this club and i was like okay cool and they're like it's downtown and i was like downtown oh girl okay that's what we doing. And so they were telling me the dress code. And it was like, uh, you need to wear a dress. And some heels. And I'm just like, ooh, girl, the heels part. I don't know. <laughs> because I used to wear heels all the time. Real shit. I used to wear it all the time. But then, at some point, I just stopped wearing heels. And it's just like, I couldn't walk in them no more. Seriously. I would literally <sighs> be walking like side to side like my feet hurt and most of the time my feet do be hurting i'm just like oh i'm a big girl trying to put these little stilettos on that's not gonna work for me like at all but anyways i got dressed okay i had on this little black dress and i had on these um khaki heels okay so i thought i i looked good all right shit i was killing it so I met up with my friend. I went to her house and she was already dressed and another friend came over. So we all just met up at her house and then we left from there. So here we go. I was like, who finna drive? Like I can drive, I don't mind driving. And they're like, okay, cool, bye, 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 bye. So we took three cars, okay? And it was like four people in each car. It was a lot of us, y'all. We just going to have a good time, you know, getting out. Throw a few drinks back. You know what I'm saying? We had everything worked out. Who was drinking? Who wasn't drinking? Like, everything was set. So, we in the car, you know, bumping to music. You know, uh-oh, killing it, dancing in the car. Doing all types of crazy shit. All right. We get downtown, okay? So, we're downtown. And I'm like, do we have to pay for parking? And they're like, nah, we just gonna park further down from the club and then just walk. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool, 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 you know? So we're walking. Literally, it felt like we walked a mile to get from where we parked to this club. Y'all, my feet was killing me. And then the road was not level. You know what I'm saying? So you have the road and you have like bumps in the road. You had holes in the road. So you have to be careful where you walk. And I'm like, girl, this is too much. Like, like I am clumsy. Okay. I would be the girl to step in a pothole and fall. Like I'm that girl. I'm literally that girl. I'm that girl that's very clumsy and that will fall in a minute. Like, seriously. So we're doing this long walk and I'm just like, are we there yet? And they're like, no. I was like, is this the club? They're like, no, Alicia, come on. Come on. I'm just like, bruh, like, oh my God. Come on, like this, this is too much. We did all this walking to get to the club. By the time I get to the club, I'm going to need a few drinks. Plus some water. And some Gatorade or something. And they're like, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. Okay, so we get there, y'all. The line is long as shit. Like, very long. Like, we stood out there for about 20 minutes. Just to even get in the club. We're literally standing outside 20 minutes. So at this point, I'm pissed off. Because I'm like, it's hot. I'm standing here in this dress. With these stripper heels on. And my feet are hurting. We need to get in this club. 
because I need to sit down. <laughs> like, at this point, I really just want to go in this club and sit down and drink. Like, literally, that's it. So they're like, you have to have patience and this and that. This is not like the normal club that's like around the corner type stuff. This is downtown club. I'm just like, girl, okay, girl, okay, whatever. So we finally get in the club, okay? We went through one door. And it was like a room. So I'm like, oh, okay, nobody was in it. It had neon lights blank room i'm just like girl okay then we have to go through another door to go through another room and then in this room it was more of neon lights and then they had like chairs all around the room so i'm guessing that was like if you just wanted to sit down and relax i said well can we sit down because that's the area i want to be in okay and they're like nah come on we finna we man we finna go in this club okay so after the second room we went in and it's like it was like a mechanic bull on one side and then you keep going the bar is on the other side so the mechanic bull is on the left side with a whole area and then you have the bar on the right side i'm just like okay so then you pass that up and you go in further in and then it's another door that you got to go through where another room and that room that was like the club room area so it was huge i mean you could see outside they had like really big tall glass windows and i'm like okay this look nice you know what i'm saying it was kind of fancy you know full of people I mean, it was packed, and the people was hood. I'm just like, oh, girl, y'all know how I feel. Woo, y'all know how I feel about being in hood clubs. Like, I just can't do it. Because, you know, anything can pop off at any moment. And I'm too bougie for that. I'm just going to be honest with you. I didn't want to tell them I was too bougie for that, but I was. Okay? So, I'm like, okay. Cool. So, we get in there, y'all. And I'm like, all right. And everybody was like, come on, you know, let's let's dance. So we're dancing. My feet are killing me. Okay. We're dancing, you know, having a good time. And then the DJ saying what he needs to say. And so we're like, okay, cool. You know, DJ up there, scoop, 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 mixing it up. And I'm like, all right. So we dance. We probably danced maybe about 15 minutes. It was like two different songs that played. No, was it two? It was three different songs. I'm sorry, not two songs. It was three different songs that played. And we were dancing, having a good time. We're dancing with each other. You know, the dudes start getting up behind you. Y'all know how they do. When you dancing, they get up behind you and, you know, start grabbing on you and dancing and stuff like that. So I'm like, okay, cool. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you do you. You know what I'm saying? Little dude got up behind me, you know, thought he was really doing so. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Thought he was really grinding and moving. I'm like, all right, bro. I'm gonna let you, I'm gonna let you keep going. Cause you know, your little waist is, 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 is really turning. I'm like, <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right so you know i'm having a good time okay feet still hurt but i'm having a good time so we just you know kicking it and everything and then my homegirl was like hey you know y'all y'all let's go get some drinks cool so i was like all right come on y'all let's go get some drink so we went out we went to go get some to drink them drinks was expensive i ain't even gonna hold you if i honestly knew how high those drinks was i would have brought my own bottle just saying like i had like a margarita but it was in a smaller margarita cup maybe about like like this this round and then regular you know it was a smaller margarita cup and that was 12 dollars and I'm just like, bro, like, I could go and get a big margarita cup at Cheddar's for that. Like, stop playing with me. You know what I'm saying? But I bought it anyway because I was thirsty. And it looked good. So, you know, I'm drinking the margarita and everything. It's like I couldn't even taste the alcohol. 
the alcohol was in there but i couldn't taste it it just tastes like a sweet margarita like i'm drinking a smoothie so i bought two of them okay and then after i bought the first one my home girl was like alicia do not buy another one she was like it's gonna sneak up on you i'm like girl they ain't even put no alcohol in this come on like come like for real she was like all right all right okay so i drank my second one after my second one i'm feeling good i'm like cool so my home girl took a shot she was like come on let's take shots i was like all right she took another shot I took a shot and I'm like, all right, cool, cool, cool. Y'all, that liquor started kicking in, okay? And when I say started kicking in, it started kicking in. Next thing I know, I'm laid across the bar table and it was a shot that was poured in my little belly button with some, you know, salt around it. And some dude was sucking it out. I'm like, oh, <laughs> what am I doing? Get up. I'm like, Alicia, get up. What is you doing? Like, you just letting strangers just suck out of your navel? Like, girl, you done drunk too much. And I'm just like, and my homegirls, I'm looking at them like, y'all hoes ain't gonna stop me. Like, y'all ain't gonna try to get me nothing. And then they're like, Alicia, come on, come on, come on. Get off this bar. Get off the bar, girl. After the dude that already sucked the, the stuff out of my neighbor, you gonna tell me to get off the bar. Boo, you should have never let me got on that bar. Let's just be honest. Y'all should have been like, you doing too much. Sis, you doing too much. Liquor is kicking in. That's what y'all should have been like. And I had on a dress, okay? So that means that y'all have seen my panties and everything laid across this damn bar. And I'm just like, this is so embarrassing. You know what I'm saying? Because I shouldn't have been laid across that bar. You know what I'm saying? And I'm kind of, you know, a thick chick. You know what I'm saying? I'm laid across the bar. And I'm just like, ooh, it's a good thing that the bar is separate from the club. Because if it was like a whole big scene, everybody would have seen it. But it was only a few that was in the bar area that actually seen it. So I was good. So after that, I pulled my little dress down. And went back in the club and started dancing. So I'm dancing, having a good time. Now I'm sweating because the alcohol is coming through my pores. So I'm just like, ooh, it's hot. Okay? It's hot. I was like, you know what? Y'all do this. I'm going to go to the other room where I can sit down in the little chair and relax. So two of my friends went with me and we just sat down and relaxed until that liquor was able to just kind of go down you know what i'm saying because it was just teen too much so i got back in i'm just like i just want to do something different then i noticed i haven't got on the mechanical bull so i'm watching people get on the bull and they're like you know cheering each other on on the bull or whatnot and i'm just like i want to get on the bull so a few of my friends was like okay cool let's get on the bull so, you know, the first girl got on the bull and she was, you know, killing it. I'm like, girl, I can do that. You know what I'm saying? But I don't really think the liquor was all the way going out of me because I didn't last no time. Okay? So I got on that bull. First of all, it was hard for me to get on the bull because I'm in a dress. Then I had to pull myself up between me feeling kind of heavy from the alcohol and being a thick girl, it was kind of hard for me to get up there on that bull, y'all. Like, I can't hold you. It was it was a little rough. But I got on the bull. I held on, scooted up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? And I probably was on that bull maybe 10 seconds, if that. You know what I'm saying? Then I just fell down and literally didn't move after that. I literally was just laying there. And my friend was like, is she all right? <laughs> Team too much. I'm going to put the clip, y'all, of me on that bull, okay? I'm going to put the clip in so y'all can actually see me on that bull, all right? Now, I'm going to have to uh, play some other music on it because I'm not going to get copyrighted. So, yeah. But I'm going to put the clip and y'all actually going to see me on the bull, okay? In my little hot dress, okay? That's all I'm saying.
ready to go and we had only been there maybe at that point maybe going on like two hours i was just ready to go because i felt like we shouldn't be at no club longer than two hours what we doing we already then you know danced and we was drinking we was on the bulls so what else are we gonna do i was ready to go so like 30 minutes after that we left in the midst of leaving out of there, I didn't took my shoes off. I didn't got real country. I was walking barefooted. And downtown is not the place for you to be walking barefooted because you don't know what's down there. Needles, anything. I am so scary. So I was just like, mm-mm. But I was walking barefooted. I walked barefooted halfway there to that car because my feet was hurting so bad my feet look like little sausages like it's like the whole foot was swollen i'm just like see team too much team too much foot should be looking like that so i wind up halfway through it putting my little shoes back on feet just killing me when i got to the car i took my shoes back off took the baby wipes out of my purse and wiped my feet off like my feet was killing me like Oh, I never felt that type of pain, you know? So we in the car and I'm just like, okay, we finna go home, y'all. We got to my homegirl house. My homegirl's like, hey, y'all wanna take a few shots before y'all go? A few what? She was like, a few shots, girl. I don't feel like taking no shots. <laughs> Girl, the day I had, I know this is too much. You know what I'm saying? To be trying to take some shots. No. But we went in the house and we took a few shots. We were talking. We was having a good time. And the next thing you know, I was out. I didn't fell asleep on the girl's sofa. So I was just like, ooh. And all the rest of them that stayed with me, they fell asleep too. She had a house of like seven people. Because everybody else pretty much went home. They didn't want to drink. But I was just like, girl, and whatever. She had a house of seven people. Seven girls. And we were just scattered everywhere. I was on the sofa. And the rest of them was on the floor. Some of them was in the bedroom, on the bed. I mean, it was just a whole bunch of stuff going on. Okay? And we were asleep. All right? We just fell asleep. We were out. And when we woke up in the morning, it was like, woo! Girl, what a night. <laughs> that was like my real like downtown club experience. And it was cool, don't get me wrong, but y'all, it was just too much. It was too much going on. I was just like, mm-mm. I see why I stick with the little club that was around, but I'm just saying. So yeah. That was my story time of me at the club and riding the bull. But make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, okay, to your girl's video, okay? So I will catch y'all next video. I need some love. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, I need some love. Oh, oh.